everyone. This is Money Mom. I wanted to give you an update about what clothes I'm donating, what I'm keeping. Let's get started and talk about it. I know that a lot of us may have more clothes than what we need, and we may have clothes of different sizes. Welcome to my world. So this is my donation bin, and sometimes I give to friends, sometimes I donate to different causes. I don't at this time sell things. I know I could do that, but I'd rather donate at this time. So I started looking through my closet and looking and seeing what am I not wearing. And not things from the past few months. I'm looking at things I haven't worn in years. That was my primary focus. Example, this beautiful peach top. It doesn't fit me, number one. But even if it did fit me, it requires ironing. Do I own an ironing board or an iron? No, I do not. And to be totally honest, I'm not very good with blouses. For some reason, I can never button them correctly and they're always uneven. So blouses are not my friend. And speaking of blouses, I also have this cute one and it's really cute, but I never wear it. I have several different pants in here. I won't go through everything, but I did actually put several pieces of clothing in here and I have some friends that I'm gonna see if they want some of these. Now I'm gonna show you what I did with the clothes I have. It looks like I have a lot, but remember, we live in an older home. We do not have a walk-in closet. So one of the things I won't be purchasing for a while, unless it's a need or maybe a cute holiday shirt for the season, I'm not going to be purchasing any clothes. So one of the things I did, and I'll just hold it up because I know you may not be able to see because it's dark over here, is in the front here on this side is I put short sleeve shirts. You guys know this is one of my favorites. I did get it on sale, I love it. I make sure not to wear this though if I'm eating barbecue or eating anything messy. I actually don't wear this if I'm eating something because you guys know I spill on myself sometimes. But anyway, I put all the short shirts here, okay? I have some extra hangers here. Then as I move it this way, I have long sleeve shirts. And you guys know that I love Lane Bryant, Women Within, and I love JCPenney. I like this brand, which one of you introduced me, St. John's Bay. And I have a bunch of long sleeve shirts that I have. And I really like these. I especially like V-neck versus round neck. That's my question. If you guys wear V-neck or round neck, which do you like better? Okay. So I have these. Then after you push that, you have sweaters, okay? And I have a lot of different sweaters. This one was from my mom. This one's the oldest, it's from the 1980s. But I have all different sweaters. I do think some of these right now would be snug on me, but if I lost just a little, it would fit me. Okay, then I also have different holiday type shirts. Some of them are quite old, but I'll just show you. So I have like, this one is my new Halloween one. It's really cute. And I have this that's old, but it's super comfy. So I have all my holiday shirts all together. Then another thing that I did is I have a couple nightwear. This is a nightgown and I'm not wearing it yet because I've already got a couple other nightgowns. So I hung it over here. And so when those get really old, I'll have a new nightgown to wear. This is so comfortable. I wish it was cold enough to wear it now. And I have some house coats. Then in the back here, and I'll pick it up, I have a couple things that I wore when I was thinner. What I did is I saved just a couple favorite items that I'm holding on to. But I did get rid of most of them, but I saved a few favorites. So that's kind of how I organized it. I know maybe it doesn't look perfect, but remember, it is a smaller closet. Now on the bottom, I have shorts on one side and pants on the other side. So that's what I've kind of done, is I have shorts on one side, pants on the other. Of course, one pair of pants fell down, and I usually just keep one pair of pants per hanger. It's easier for me to see what I actually have in my closet. When you have a bunch of things on one hanger or it's all clumped together, you can't see what you have. So I just wanted to briefly show you what I'm doing with my clothes. Before signing off, let me ask you guys, 
Are any of you organizing your clothes at this time? You know I love to hear from you in the comments below. That's all I have to say for now. I love you. I appreciate you. And like always, I hope to see you on the next video. Bye-bye.